Uh, I like the complexity of the subject as uh, there's more interesting topics and uh, modules that like that require you to understand like more further than GCSE level as like as all, before we wouldn't really use we just learn stuff but like not really understand what we're what we're trying to do. Uh, if I had a level chemistry it's a satisfying subject I think because you, you understand why things are the way they are and I think knowing about that is quite a powerful thing. Uh, it's much more intense than uh, GCSE, more content, more application of knowledge, stuff like that. So it's, uh, and it kind of requires more independent learning, so it's like, it focuses more on you. So it's different, uh, it's different in the way like, there's more maths, but I don't think that's too bad if you understand like, why you're doing it. And um, you learn, you learn not just, in school they just tell you, but now like, you understand why, and you go through how you, like, you understand stuff in chemistry at high level. Uh, lots of math skills, so calculating and just in equations and uh, like exam questions and stuff like that. Uh, a lot of application of knowledge and like the longer essay questions and stuff like that and um, um, just like communication skills so when you're doing practicals and like you, you need that good like chemistry. I think problem solving is a big one because a lot of the, a lot of the questions are designed around problem solving and understanding what the question's asking. Uh, A-level requires more like professional set of skills, so m more than GCSE, so it's, uh, it's more advanced. Uh, more, yes, I said that, more maths, uh, more understanding, uh, like why rather than school just telling you, GCSE just telling you the answer. More practical work? Yeah, you do a bit more practical, obviously not, not too sure about now, the corona, but um, right. yeah, you do do more. Uh, I was thinking going into chemical engineering, so which which requires a lot of chemistry and like finding materials that are good for like solving problems. So if there's like a physics problem that that needs a certain material that has high tensile strength or something, something like that, uh, it's like uh, it's to do with um, just creating new new materials using chemistry, so reactions and stuff like that to. Uh, just solve the problems that they required. I'm going to apply for uh, biomed and chemistry. So actually, both of them do include quite a lot of chemistry. Obviously, chemistry does, but biomed does as well. So even biology-related courses, you do need chemistry. So it's so a valuable, valuable A level. Mm -hmm.